Welcome back everyone, my name is Joe and today I'm starting a brand new series and this series is completely dedicated towards Essentials X. So this is a, such a useful plugin to have on your server. It is the newer version of the previous plugin Essentials, what hasn't been updated since 2015. So these guys have got hold of the plugin, uh, the source code, because it's freely available. They've updated it for the last couple of, you know, for the last many versions since 1.7. They've added new features in, they've done improvements, so I highly recommend it. I've used it on all my servers since, um, you know, the actual old essentials ran, uh, stopped working on some of the servers. So it's a very useful plugin. So over this course of this series, I will be going in deep in certain parts of the config commands and so on. And if you guys want to recommend anything, please just leave a comment saying, um, such as, you know, can you explain the AFK system, let's say, and so on. So then... The first video is actually how to install the plugin onto your server. So we don't want to, you want to go down to the description, click on the spigot link. And once you're on this page, you want to click on this big uh, green uh, download button or greeny blue um, download button. And this will take you to the uh, build page where they release all their updates. So as you see here, uh, they've actually released a update today. So they update the plugin quite often. So we're going to click on the latest updates. And as you see here, they fixed the problem with, you know, clearing inventory. So they're constantly updating it. So the ones I recommend you to actually download to start off with is Essentials X, Essentials X Chat, Essentials X uh, Protect, and Essentials X Spawn. So these are the main ones I use on a server when I'm building it. Uh, there, there, of course, there's a few more. So there's, you know, anti-build and so on. But I will hopefully go over these in a later video. So then. Uh, also, the plugin does recommend you will need Vault if you want to use, um, you know, if you want to change up chats, groups, and stuff like this. Uh, this is if you're running a, a permissions plugin. So I just recommend you have Vault anyway. So there'll also be a link uh, down below to get this plugin. So we're just going to click uh, download. Wait for it to connect. There we go. So we have downloaded it. So now we need to put these into the actual server. So make sure you get your server all here. So we're going to go to the plugins. It's currently empty and we're just going to drop and drag these plugins in here just like that. So now we're going to start the server up. So we'll just give it a second to start up. There we go. So it's just uh, generating. And as you see here, it has actually uh, created its own folder, you know, and so on and vault has activated as well so now if we actually go back into plugins you'll see we've actually got a couple more folders so the main one we're going to be focusing on over this series is essentials and as you see here there's a config items kits and uh, so on even there's a warp folder when you uh, actually set warps so then so hopefully hopefully this tutorial has helped you get started so then that is the tutorial it is very short and this is what i'm planning to do have lots of little short videos in a playlist so I hope you guys have liked it. Make sure you subscribe, like, favourite. I don't think that's actually favourite anymore. So make, make sure you go and follow me on Twitter. There we go. But anyway, guys, thanks a lot. I'll see you next time in the next video. Goodbye.